Hello tea drinkers and anti-rioters. Um, well done for everything you've done so far. I'm a little bit late to the party, uh, but I thought I would show you how to make something a little bit stronger than a cup of tea, if uh, you're that way inclined like I am. Um, it is a tea-based drink, and, um, and it's super easy to make with ingredients that you can get in any shop, and uh, the martini glass is, is optional, but it's a nice, it's a nice touch. And it's the English breakfast martini. Okay, very simple to make. It's a gin-based drink. I'm using Plymouth gin, because unfortunately I don't have any London gin, which would probably be better, um, but Plymouth gin's nice and soft. And it's one shot of that. Plymouth gin. And uh, we're going to be using elderflower, which is really lovely. Nice and summery. Hopefully get you back in the mood for summer after all this rubbish. And if you don't have this Saint Germain elderflower liqueur, you could use elderflower cordial and uh, maybe bulk it up with half a shot of vodka or something like that. Um, and I'm just pouring this into a, just a normal tumbler style glass with a load of ice in it. Um, then, obviously, tea. I've got from my little Chinese teapot some tea that's been brewing for a while now. And it's just one shot of that as well. A bit short there. And then half a shot of lemon juice that I squeezed from this lemon a second ago. Dump that in. Stir it around with ice. You could shake it, but since it's nearly clear, Stir it. Oh, I almost forgot. The recipe that I'm going to link for calls for an orange zest. I don't have any oranges, so I'm going to put one dash of orange bitters in here. If you've got an orange, that's probably better. But stir it around. Make sure it's nice and cold. The glass that I'm using has been in the freezer, so it's already pretty cold. And strain that. We have a tea strainer, obviously, into the martini glass. Cheers. Well done for all the work you've done. I'm going to have to buy myself some of that charity tea. And, um, and yeah, stay safe, everyone. Show these people that Britain's not a load of idiots after all. Cheers. Lovely.